welcome to another video. I am Debbie. Today I have another video in my Diamond Art Club series for my stash. I am not de-stashing anything, but just wanted to show you my Diamond Art Club stash and to see if there's anything that you would want me to work on immediately. And also to see some of these are still available with Diamond Art Club and then some you might can find in a de-stash group. But today I'm going to focus on Randall Spangler. I have several um, from him. And then next week I'm going to focus on miscellaneous artists, but it's going to be on landscapes. So, and then I will probably be wrapping it up after, not next week, but the following week. So I'm getting closer. But this one, the first one is called Customized Bookshelf. It is a 92 by 41 centimeters and it has 52 colors. And I think that this one will go really fast. There seems to be quite a bit of color blocking in this. I'm not sure when I'm going to do any of these, but um, I have them out. I have a shelf that my husband built for me that is in our basement. And so I can just go pull what I want because I have all of the smaller thumbnails on the bottom of my boxes so I know exactly what everything is. That took a long time. Okay, the next one, some of these are going to have to be sideways, unfortunately. And if the audio is not as clear as it has been, I do apologize. I decided to go ahead and do this one in my basement because I really didn't want to carry all these back upstairs into my dining room and then I have to bring them all back down the stairs. So I was kind of lazy on that, but wanted to go ahead and also get this done. This one I've had for a while. I've started on the bottom with my daughter, and then we just kind of started doing something else. We started on this last summer. This has 53 colors, and as you can see at the bottom, this is how much that we've gotten done. And actually it was quite a bit, about I guess two rows maybe, um, but this one is so many books, so little time, and this is 56 by 109 centimeters. My daughter Paige has an extra room, so she really has two rooms, and in her extra room, she has what she calls her library slash office. I don't know why she has an office. She was um, taking online classes, so that's one reason why she called it her office, but she has a lot of books, and so she wants to hang this in her in her office close to her bookshelf. So we'll eventually get it done. This one has been hanging up for a long time. So at least it is straight for the most part and we've gotten some of this done. So hopefully we can work on it together this summer. I think that's the longest one that I have of Randall Spangler's. This one I really like too. It is 50 colors. This is universe in a jar. It is 56 by 64 centimeters. And this one's going to be a lot of color blocking. So when I get ready to do something for color blocking, when I really get tired of all the confetti that I've been working on, I think I'm gonna grab this one. It won't take very long. And I'm also going to bling it up with some additional um, specials. So that's gonna be really pretty. The next one, this one's a really long one. This one may be, I think it's larger than the other one. It is. Um, this one is Train of Dreams. Let's start over here so I can see a little bit. It has 57 colors. It is 173 by 46 centimeters. And I just really like this one. My dad and I used to play with uh, Lionel trains. He had a really nice train set when I was little. And so I saw this, I thought of him, and I thought, how cool would it be to do this? Well, I didn't think about how large this was when I bought it. It's been in my stash for a long time. And my dad has no place to put this, and it looks kind of, you know, childish because it has a lot of, you know, little kid things on here. But I do want to do it at least, and then I'll figure out what we're going to do, if anything, once it's done. But it is extremely long, so it's going to take a while. There is some color blocking in that. That's going to help, but it's still going to take a long time to do. This one is Flight of Fireflies. It's another one that is going to be a lot of color blocking, I believe, especially all this black. It is 40 colors. Um, Flight of the Fireflies, 56 by 56 centimeters. This one is 
I think a little unusual um, for Randall Spangler's work, and I saw it and just loved it. It is it has 51 colors, and this one is some enchanted evening. Looking at this upside down, it's 70 by 118 centimeters. So, and you're also looking at it sideways. But I love fairies. There's, there's a fairy over here on this side, and then also. Um, a lot of, you know, greenery here. It could be Christmas, which I thought was really cute. A bunch of um, fairies at the bottom. Kind of looks like Santa at the bottom there. So I think this will be really fun to do. Another large one, though. Again, with all these large ones, I have no idea what I'm going to do with them when I finish. This one is 52 colors. It is the Literate Dragon. It is a 70 by 70, so not as large as the other ones. A rather good size. And um, she also wanted this in her library. So we're going to work on this one together. I think there's going to be quite a bit of color blocking in certain places. And we will work on this. She's not very good with uh, using a lot of different colors. Um, so confetti doesn't really suit her very well. But a lot of this she can do because that's all color blocking here in the books. And a lot of this, is, um, it's not really color blocking, but it's only two or three colors, so that won't be too bad. And then I have another one here. This is the last one. This one is Curl Up with a Good Book. And this one is 55 colors. It's a 70 by 70. And so I think she wanted this one to go into my office where my books are. So we'll see, and um, what we really like is this little cat that's up here. We love cats, we have a cat, and we thought that was really cute. That's kind of what our cat does when we are laying in bed reading together, and the cat will come up and just kind of stare at us over a bunch of pillows. So my daughter loves pillows, she has pillows all over her bed, and we thought that was just really funny, reminded us of Salem. So that is all that I have today, and especially for Randall Spangler. I didn't want to put anything together because these are so different and unique, and I wanted to just have the um, Spanglers together like I did on all the others. So again, next week I will focus on landscapes. I have several artists, and then the following week will be miscellaneous, which more than likely it's more so of fantasy, which is what you'll see. Thanks so much for watching, and until next time, happy diamond painting. Bye.